Welcome to the world. Look closely. What do you see? It looks like flight patterns or global trading routes, right? In a way, it is. That pink line shows movement of counterfeit goods. The purple lines, those are some of the pathways for selling women and children. And the yellow lines, they trace key routes for smuggling cocaine. This network of illegal activity crisscrosses the planet for one purpose, to turn a profit. After all, many criminals are just business people. Now, what they sell, buy, or distribute is very different from what we think of as our global economy. But it's big business, very big. Imagine all the crime in the world under the banner of a single company. That business, let's call it Crime Incorporated, would bring in more money than the top 50 Fortune 500 companies combined. What does this global business of crime look like? And how can we map its influence? Well, Crime Inc. has plenty of local branches open for business. And that's because just like every successful business, Crime Incorporated has identified a growing market that wants its products. In this case, a black market. Half of the world's working population, almost 1.8 billion people, are employed in shadowy black market jobs. Want to buy body parts? What's your budget? A small intestine will set you back around 2,500 bucks. But the big money is in kidneys. They go for up to $260,000. That might explain why kidneys are 75% of the illegal global body parts market. But nearly one out of every $2 spent on the black market goes to buying drugs. Big Data Mining, 매주 화요일 밤 10시 본방송. 내셔널 지오그래픽 채널.